Hi everyone and welcome to the Astarsi Dragon channel. Uh, this is, uh, let's see, this is an oracle review um, the, of The Universe Has Your Back, a 52 card deck by Gabrielle Bernstein. Artwork by Misselia Ezra. So uh, let's see what's going on with it. Shall we? Hi, miracle worker. Oh, well, let me read this then. Because we're all miracle workers, right? Hi, miracle worker. I'm so excited that you picked up the universe has your back cards. My hope is that this deck will help you to deepen your connection to the innermost part of yourself and to the universe. In that connection, you will... You will be uh, guided to your true purpose, to be love and spread love. Well, let me just pull the rest of this out. Obviously, there is no, um, there's no guidebook. There's the back of it. Meselia and I have lovingly crafted these wor words and images to bring you guidance and inspiration. These cards and their deep sentiments are intended to accompany and lift you as you travel inward. Choose one whenever you seek clarity of heart, loving direction, or a return to your own intuition. Each card carries a potential gift uh, which can awaken a presence of joy within, help you transform your fear into faith, and remind you that the universe has your back. Wishing you a miraculous journey with love, Gabrielle. Thanks, Gabrielle. We all appreciate that. Let's measure these cards before I start reading them. Uh, about five inches or just under 13 centimeters by... Four inches, or what is that? Just under ten centimeters. Centimeters. Okay. Let's see. Mm. There we go. As good as it's gonna get. Okay. So let's see what we got going. Oh, there's uh, bios and stuff on the back. Excellent. Okay. The moment I realign with love, clear direction is presented to me. True healing occurs when I give myself permission to feel whatever feelings live below the triggers. There is nothing sexier than my authentic truth. In every moment, the universe is conspiring to bring me toward every, or toward right-minded thinking and the energy of love. When I'm connected to my joyful presence, I attract support from the universe. The moment I embrace my peace within and surrender the outcome is the moment that the universe can truly get to work. Joy is the ultimate creator. Agreed. I always trust the direction of the universe and know I'm being guided. There is a stream of love supporting my dreams. The universe works fast when I'm having fun. When I lean on the faith of the universe, peace becomes real. The more energy and intention I bring to my faith, the more fearless I am. Are the more fearless and free I am. Oneness is my true nature. 
when I'm in alignment with the love of the universe, peace cannot be disrupted. I am the loving energy of the universe. Okay. Sorry, they stuck. Hope is the conduit for miracles. I surrender to a power greater than me. In any moment, I can surrender to the powerful presence of love through prayer, contemplation, and stillness. When I lean on certainty and faith, I change my mind about the world I see. My faith has the power to turn trauma into healing, conflict into growth, and fear into love. My capacity to tune in to the energy of love gives me the words I need when I'm ready to speak up, the compassion I need when it's time to forgive, and the power I need when I am lost. I choose to learn through love. The presence of love will always cast out fear. When I lean toward love, I am led. Through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. My outer experiences are a reflection of my internal condition. My happiness is a direct reflection of my level of faith in the universe. I find a deeper meaning and personal growth amid the discomfort. I choose love no matter what. Agreed. My fearless freedom lights up the world. Attack, pain, fear, judgment, and any form of separation are merely calls for help. When I think I've surrendered, I surrender more. I witness the darkness and call on the light with my prayer. Thank you, universe, for guiding me to pursue Perceive this fear through the eyes of the teacher of love. When I accept the love of the universe as my primary teacher, I will always be guided back to the light. My vibes speak louder than my words. I am the dreamer of my dream. I'm, un I'm unapologetic about what I desire and trust that I focus, that what I focus on will grow. Well, the mouthful for me, isn't it? Energy flows where my intention goes. The key to prayer is to forget what I think I need. I honor how I want to feel. Happiness is my birthright. Obstacles are detours in the right direction. Thank you universe for helping me see beyond the limits of fear. Thank you for expanding my perceptions so that I can see what is of the highest good. The universe has my back. <laughs> my energy creates my reality. What I focus on is what I will manifest. 
Instead of praying for an outcome, I pray for the highest good for all. I create mindful moments throughout the day reminding myself that I am love and miracles are natural. When I focus on my inner light, I see the world through the lens of love. I let go of the shadow of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love. I recognize that I have chosen fear and I choose again. I choose love. I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. I am a spirit having a human experience and I'm here to get closer to love. Beautiful. And those are the cards. So, um, great cards for like daily affirmations. Uh, they would probably be really good uh, guidance for um, as oracles uh, in a tarot reading, but um, these are great cards. They uh, hopefully they send to you. If they did, I do have an affiliate link in the description box below. Other than that, uh, if there are other decks you would like for me to review. Just put them in the comment uh, section below and uh, let me know what they are so I can locate them and review them for you. Other than that, have a great day and I will see you on the next video.